U.S. shares. Disney's stock sinks after the entertainment giant reports a loss for the first quarter. Nevertheless, Disney boss Bob Iger tells investors we've turned the corner as the firm's streaming division finally turns a profit, six months earlier than it promised Wall Street. Also coming up, pressure in the pipeline. BP profits slump. The results are worse than expected, raising further questions about the oil giant's business plan. Plus, back on the radar for U.S. regulators, Boeing faces a new safety investigation, this time over the 787 Dreamliner. Hello, welcome to Business Today. I'm Michelle Fleury. U.S. markets have made a muted start here in New York. Shares of Disney sinking after the entertainment giant reported a loss for the first three months of the year. Now, that's despite the bombshell. In other news, the Swiss banking giant UBS has reported a better than expected jump in earnings for the first three months of the year, delivering their first quarterly profits since the takeover of Credit Suisse. UBS blocked in a, clocked in a net profit of $1.8 billion, up from a $279 million loss in the previous quarter. Nintendo has posted record profits thanks to the weak yen, but warned Earnings will slump nearly 40% this year. The video games giant says it will reveal a successor to the hit Nintendo Switch console later this year. Well, before we go, let's take a look at the markets in the rest of the world. Uh, we've seen a mixed picture in Europe. Actually, no, I should say all in the green right now. Uh, in the US, uh, Peloton is one of the big movers today on reports of private equity interest. That is all we have time for. Stay with us here on BBC.